<laughs> Good morning, everybody. It's Miss Kristen and Goose here. And today we're going to talk about one of the most important things about being a Christian, which is giving and service work, right? It is so important as a Christian to help your community and get out there. And that's one of the things I think I miss most about being in a church is all of the giving and service projects that you get to be a part of, right? And sometimes when I sit at home, I feel like I'm not doing enough. Well, one of the great things right now that is going on is so many people are adopting puppies and dogs because they have the time to train them. And a lot of people are adopting them from the shelters, which is so great. That's where we got Goose. Goose, can you say hi? He's a little rambunctious right now. That's where we got Goose. And we are so lucky we found him. And there's more that we can do for our local shelters. So today what we're gonna do is we are going to make dog treats and some dog toys to donate to the shelter. And they're gonna be really easy and they're gonna be really fun. We're gonna do two different types of dog toys and one dog treat recipe. And if you're more of a cat person, that's fine. I'll put a link up so that you can do your own thing to give to the cats. But I'm more of a dog person, so we're just gonna do some dog treats today. And we're gonna get started on that and it's gonna be really fun. And for all you devoted cat lovers out there, this is a link that will send you to a video that might help you make some fun cat toys for cats in the shelter. Okay, so we're going to get started today by making dog treats. Now, these are really simple and easy to make dog treats. They are flourless, which is good. They're healthy. It's three ingredients, but it does have peanut butter. So if you're someone with a nut allergy or you're close to someone who has a nut allergy, just be mindful that this maybe isn't the right recipe for you. And if you are going to be around someone with a nut allergy, make sure people know that this is something that has nuts in them. Okay, we're going to start off by preheating our oven to 350 degrees. All right, we need three ingredients for this. We need oats, which you put in a blender, one one-fourth cups of oats, blend it to make it like a fine powder. Then we're going to use a heaping half a cup of peanut butter. It's good to go over on this. And we're going to use one banana. I know my banana looks gross, but don't worry, it's good. It was just over ripened in the freezer. So we are going to add our half a cup of peanut butter first, and then our banana. Now we want to mash this really good so it's a nice blended smooth consistency. So I'm going to take my masher. I'm doing this with one hand so it's a little difficult, but let's see what we get. I like this consistency. This is good. So now it's time to add our oats. Now our blended oats are going to act kind of like a flour would. We're going to put it in our recipe and then it is going to make it so it's not sticky so it's just like a good doughy moldable consistency that we can then mold it and shape it into dog treat form now I'm gonna put it here on my greased pan and I'm just gonna make dog bone shapes but you can make any shape you want you can do the letter of your name the letter of your dog's name if you have it now let's put it in the oven and we're going to bake that now I set aside just a little bit of the batter because Goose loves frozen peanut butter treats. So I just made little balls and I'm going to pop those in my freezer and I'm also going to let those sit for like 15-30 minutes. Okay, so now let's wait and see what our results are. About 15 minutes later I'm going to take my dog treats out of the oven and the freezer. I'm going to let them set and harden for a minute and then let's see what Goose thinks about them. Do you want a treat? Do you want a treat, Mr. Goose? Mr. Goose? Mama's got a treat for you. Ah, uh, that's not how we act. Goose touch. Touch. Good boy. Mmm. What do you think, buddy? Do you like it? Yummy. Oh, I don't have any more, Mr. Goose. Goosey baby, do you want a treat? Goose sit. Goose high five. High five. High five, Goose. Goosey high five. High five, Goose. High five. Goose high five. Good. High five, Goose. Here you go. What a good boy. All 
right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope your dog treats come out great. And keep looking out for my next video where we make dog toys to also donate to the shelter.